Another thing we're coming up against over the past 12 to 24 months with banks is that just because a, a deal fits the parameters of what they would usually lend against, there is always some, some external bits of play that may stop them from doing that. So you might have a, a project uh, in a certain location that you've done a project next door and you've just finished it and that bank's funded it and you go and see them about funding the next project and you might come up against something, well, we've actually hit our lending cap for that suburb. We've hit our lending cap for that state. Um, we've hit our lending cap for apartments. We've hit our lending cap for service stations in that particular area. So it is something that is critical to know that that, that can actually happen. And, and in that instance, it doesn't mean there's anything wrong with your project. It just means that you will need to find another bank that has the appetite for that deal at that particular time. It, it is important to know that sometimes, for no particular reason, a bank will not want to fund your project, but that's for us to find out and deliver that information to you. Certainly nothing to be worried about, because it doesn't mean that they won't be back doing that lending for you in another 12, 18 months time. It's just that at a particular time, there is some, some things at play within their banks that are not allowing to fund the project. So it's just, all it is is a matter of saying, you know, thanks for the business, let's go and talk to another bank.